Welcome to Retro Machines, my name is Victor Bart and I caught some issues with my Seagate 8TB SAS drives with uh, ZFS and Linux in Procmox. So this video is not a tutorial but I'm gonna show you what kind of errors I caught and my solution to fix it. So I made a storage pool and I caught some strange error. Print, reg error, protection error, device SDE. And when I do a scrub, the error replicates itself. So let's wait on the error. And you see nine read errors on the device that ends at CF. It's now repairing and it cuts from nine to 12. And we have the error again, and we have now 15. So that is really strange. So I searched on Google what it could be. I didn't find much about it, but some interesting forum threads, I will link them below. And I was also discussing it with my good friend Dookie Rick. He also has a YouTube channel, I will link it below. He makes videos about computers, servers, he has a very nice Sun server with I think 12 dual core CPUs and he's into cars. He has a really interesting uh, channel, you should check him out. But we were checking stuff together and see what it could be and we found out something strange. So if we check the smart status we see something strange and that is formatted with type 2 protection. We were thinking yeah maybe that is the issue. So what I have done tonight was formatting the SDF with the tool SG format. And here you see uh, both uh, drives on the screen. The upper drive is the SDE drive and the lower drive is the SDF drive. And the SDF drive was giving errors before but now it doesn't give the errors. And formatted with type 2 protection is now gone by this drive. So what I'm going to do is formatting the other 5 drives. So the formatted with type 2 protection is removed. Probably that will solve my issue uh, that I have now. So let me show you how I gonna do that. But first I gonna show you the most powerful command with setpool. That is setpool destroy storage. And it is gone. So with one comment without any questions, are you sure? You lose all your data with this comment. So don't use setpool destroy. It's really powerful and it doesn't ask if you are sure. So I gonna use the tool sg format, dash dash format, dash dash size is 512, slash device slash sda because that is the first 8 terabyte hard drive and then enter. And here it will ask for 15 seconds, are you sure? Because this uh, format will destroy everything. Format unit has started, but it will probably take 20 to 24 hours. So what I gonna do is in the next console, I gonna do the same, but for the next hard drive. And the next hard drive is the SDD. So we are back in the first console and it is now on 0.18% and the second one on 0.08% so that will really take a long time. Please don't see this video as a tutorial but rather see this as an example what possibly can be a solution for your issues. Please check everything, ask people that know a lot about ZFS before you can use the commands that I'm showing here because they are really powerful. So when this is done, I gonna remake the RAID set 2 again, but this time with 4K sectors. I forget it last time, that's an extra command, the A shift uh, 12 option. But I gonna put the correct info that you can use on the screen and I don't gonna use the disk labels S, D, A, D, E, F, G and H, but I gonna use the path to the disk ID. And that's a little bit safer if you mix up hard drives later. Thanks for watching. And if you like to support me, I have Patreon, I have Amazon affiliated links. 
I have Twitter and you can join Retro Machines on Facebook.